I'm going to be doing my long-awaited apartment tour ever since I moved into my new apartment. You guys have been really asking to see it and I told you guys I would show you. So I'm going to show you it now. I've been living here for about a month now, but I'm going to show you everything. It's not completely done and it's not completely clean either, but I hope you guys can bear with me and I will do a fully completely updated one once everything is exactly how I want it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you do and let's jump into it. So first when you come in I have this little white shelf that was actually originally brown that I got from Amazon and then I just hang my keys up there and then right into the right is the laundry room and all the kitty stuff. So I have all kinds of laundry soap and random things and just stuff kind of everywhere. Then Luna has her bed, her kitty litter, and then there's all kinds of food and dog food and all that good stuff. Up here is some more random stuff, of course. <laughs> Now back out to the living room, I have my Chase Lounge, which I'm trying to actually sell. I don't quite like how it goes in this room since it is brown and I'm going for more of a gray look, but I think it looks fine here for now. And then I have this rug from Overstock, I have this table from Amazon, and the two, the couch and the chair are both from Pier 1. So under here I just like to keep lots and lots of blankets and then this cute little decorative vase down here. And then some more decorative things up top, including a candle. And my dad actually made the top for this table to match my dresser, so I love it. And then just some more blankets and pillows and all sorts of comfy goodness. Over here, this table is from the Home Goods store, and then this lamp is from Target. And then my couch is from Pier 1 and the pillows are from Wally World. And then I have just, I love these white fluffy pillows, they're so comfy. And then I have this painting that was from Overstock, which I am in love with. Now over to the right is my sitting area and my dad made the base of the table and then it has a glass top and I'm doing a puzzle on it right now, normally there's stuff on top. And then the chairs were from Pier 1. So here's the dresser that we redid, and yes, it was from Goodwill, and it was really ugly, and we refurbished it. Then just a massage chair, and this clock from Overstock, which I think is really, really cool, and just kind of different, although it was a pain to hang. And then I have this TV that I actually need to switch out with the TV in my bedroom and kind of switch it since this one's smaller, just haven't gotten around to doing it yet. This is also from Pier 1, and I got this really pretty vase not that long ago from the TJ Maxx Home Goods store. I'm not going to spend too much time in the kitchen because it is just a kitchen, very self-explanatory. I do have a pantry, which is really nice, and then just a gas stove, which is a bit different for me. It's kind of old school, but yeah. And then some pretty flowers, and that is my kitchen. Very basic. <laughs> Here I have this painting from Target, this lamp from Amazon, and I, this was a Marilyn Monroe puzzle I did. Then I just have my futon, which eventually I want to spruce up a bit, and then my messy old filming station. To the right is my closet, so in here I have all my dresses on this side, and then some jeans and tank tops and that little foldy thing, shoes on the bottom, and then like a wall full of shoes that I kind of need to organize, and then all my tank tops and shirts are on this side, and then my longer sleeve shirts are on this side. Over here I have some bulletin boards, which I hope to put up some cards that you guys send me once I get a P.O. box, and then I just have my desk and all that good stuff. Now you guys, I had to share this with you guys. This is my shirt. And basically, it's like a shirt for your chair. And Luna had completely destroyed my leather chair. And I was going to buy a whole new one. And if you've ever bought one, you know they're so expensive. So this is an awesome little cover. You could wash it. It's amazing. There's so many awesome designs. I even have a white one. 
but it gives your chair a whole new makeover for the fraction of the cost of a new chair and they are super super soft so I got this pretty chevron one and then I forgot to film the bathroom in here which is over to the right onto my bed these pillows are from the home goods store as is this really pretty blanket that my brother got me I love it um, I still need to hang up my jewelry board and take some bags to Goodwill then I have my dresser over here and my jewelry and there's the TV that needs to be moved out to the living room this painting is also from the home goods store my mom got it for me and I absolutely love it then I got some lamps from Amazon, and then this cute little thing from Kirkland's. This little clock, not a little thing, a clock. And then on my larger dresser, I have some candles and perfumes, and those little pretty trays are from Kirkland's too. On to the bathroom. My curtain is from Target. Both the rugs are from the Home Goods store. I just have some random stuff up on my counter or like daily stuff I use. Of course my sink, pretty basic. And then these really pretty towels from the home goods store as well. And then there's also a walk-in closet in here and this just has games and crafts and random sorts of things like so. And then there's also a linen closet that I still need to organize. All right guys, I hope you enjoyed my apartment tour. I'm going to get into my subscriber of the week in a second. And also I wanted to remind you guys that if you are interested in getting the chart like I showed on my chair, I have a $5 off coupon code for you so that way you don't have to go out and buy a whole new chair. So I will leave that down below and you can have the best looking chairs ever. And also for my subscriber of the week, if you aren't familiar with this, basically every Saturday I choose a subscriber who both interacts with me on YouTube and social media. So this week is Emily Robbins and Emily has been tweeting me all the time and I absolutely love it. She tried out some of my healthy snacks and sent me a picture. So congrats Emily, send me your shipping address and I will get your little package sent off to you. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this and liked it. Um, if you have any ideas of how I should decorate some stuff, feel free to let me know. I'm always interested in new ideas. So I will see you guys next time and hope you all have an awesome day. Bye.